Good morning, class. Today's mapping lesson will be centered on what I am labeling as the main line and is shown in the yellow highlight. The first half follows what is shown on the state map. The second half is the added red line. What is in the green highlight is what is shown on the state map and I will refer to as the exit to Lake Road. From this exit to Lake Road, there are several connections back down to the main trail and down to North Canyon Return. All of those will be covered in the next episode. However, I will be stopping briefly along the right to point out where they join the main trail. You will notice I accidentally say high road sometimes, but meant lake road. Both are equally awful. Similarly, there are several connections from the main trail to those that connect to other segments, which will be shown in part six, which goes over the early out areas. Those have already been shown in my previous video on skidding down unmaintained trails. I'll put a link in the description to those videos, but we'll show where they are in part six. Lastly, at the end of the Troll Trail main line, there is an option to exit back to Lake Road or descend down a long rut all the way back down to the bottom. I'm including this on the map and ride as bonus material. It is shown in magenta and is why this video is so long. However, I won't consider this part of the Troll Trail. I'm probably going down it the wrong way as well, but I've never met anyone on it even on a weekend. Just turn off your engine, go slow, and keep your ears open for the short part along Lake Road. So, removing the highlight and replacing the state map black dashed lines with red, here is what the map looks like at this point. I'll put it up again at the end of the video. So, now let's ride. <laughs> So this is one of the crossovers. I'll show you in a separate video with the alternate entries and the crossovers. Not sure which should be the official direction on that this one, but continuing on with the main line. There it is. So, I don't, I don't know. I don't know if this is part of Troll Trail. I showed you going down this on my other video, skidding down steep descents. I think it was the third trail on part one. I'll show you when, on the video, including early out where it connects. <laughs>
So this is where early out goes on the left. Alternate entry number one comes in here. And this is the main line we're doing. And you see this? Just noticed the fender in the tree. That's another of those skidding trails on my part two of skidding down. I don't recommend going down that one. It's got a lot of poison oak. This is another skidding down. That was part two of, well, second skid in part two. And here's where alternate entry number two joins us. third skidding trail. A lot of footprints. Must have been somebody having fun this weekend. So on the right is where alternate entry number three comes in. This just makes a loop, joins back up here. Wasn't planning on going on it, but might as well to be complete. So we'll end up right there.
back where we started from. So, not sure what to call that line. We're gonna take this one because it's the way to make the longest trail that gets you to Troll Meadow. This will as well, but I'm gonna call this more of a exit back to high road, but there are connections that will get you back onto this trail to get Troll Meadows and we'll show you. Most people have been taking this, it takes you into a drainage which gets you down to Scandia Basin. I'm saying this is the main trail that people miss because it's in the middle of the hairpin.
you can go left or straight here, they just all come back together. So this is one of those connections from that exit back to high road. And this does take you all the way down to the bottom. There's North Canyon Return Hill. You can also go down this way or this way. They, they merge right back up. That one's straight. Got more little roots, obstructions. That joins up. I haven't tried going up it. Those roots are going to be slippery. Now another intersection. North Canyon Road is down there, very short. Our pat mission is to go this direction. This is another one of those connectors from that exit to high road back down to here. Not for beginners. <laughs>
world famous Troll Meadows. That's another connector from that road to Lake Road. I think I said High Road too, but it's Lake Road. And that's another exit back to North Canyon Road at the bottom. We'll cover those in different videos. Our path is this way. Troll bridge, and you know what lives under troll under bridges, right? Trolls. So he, there is one down there. You might want to look. I think I have a picture of him with a match, ready to burn this place up. I think. <laughs> Don't go there. Well, it looks like someone broke the gate again, but they have it fenced off. People keep breaking it. Don't do that. Just stay here. Maybe they're doing it because they don't know how to get to the trails. So, not sure where Troll Trail really ends because this is the olive orchard and you can take this practically all the way down to the bottom or you can take it here back to Lake Road. We'll do that. Back at Lake Road. At the end of the Troll Trail is this, I don't know what you want to call it, mostly a rut. Parallels Lake Road 
an alternative way to get back down to cars and all that without having to be on boring roads. Here, you can take the rut, or there's a nicer trail on the left. Well, at least it's nice for now. Eventually it'll become a big rut. For the record, that was the first time down I made it without dabbing once. So we're on Lake Road here, and we're gonna go backwards on Lake Road to join up with the other connector. Have the engine off so we can hear if anybody's coming. It's late, it's a weekday. I don't think anybody's riding. Here we go, down into this rut. Here we are, back at the bottom.